So now camp is all organized. We're gonna grab our fishing gear and get out on the lake. Well, as Hubie and I were canoeing around, we came by Austin, and as we were, he he just caught a fish. So it's a little bluegill. Can't quite tell if it's a keeper it's yet. Not, it's not big enough to keep, but I did hook it near the eye. But it'll be all right. And there it goes. It's in here somewhere now. So after fishing for a little while, just outside our camp, there's we realized there's a lot of bluegill and potential to catch a lot of fish. So we're gonna need to get some live bait though to do so because we did not bring any. So let's go right now and let's get some live bait. Oh baby, let's go. Look at that worm. Nice. Big score. Put it in the bag here. Ready? Two, one. There's one. No. Oh here's one, here's one. Like Mason, see the one you got. That's a nice one. Nice one. Oh, here's one. Here's one. Yes. Nice. There's a big boy for the. That's a nice one. Oh, here's one. Here's one. Nice. We got our worms. It's time to start fishing. This area out here has a ton of bluegill, so we're just gonna stay right by our camp and fish here. Our goal Austin is, to is gonna fish on shore, and I'm fishing with Mason in the canoe. Yep. And our goal is to get two or three decent sized bluegill that we can cook up for lunch. Let's go. So the setup for today is just gonna be a simple slip bobber. And where I'm fishing, it's about two feet deep. So I put this about a foot and a half. Then a nice slip bobber. And then I just have kind of kind of a big jig for today, but they were biting on it earlier. Same thing I caught my first fish on. So then um, I just tipped the j jig with about an inch of worm, the night crawler we got. And these guys were stealing my bait earlier, like almost every cast. So I basically wove it through the entire hook so they don't take it as easily. So yeah, this should work. It got really hot out while we were fishing, and since the fish weren't really biting, we figured might as well just wait later till later tonight so it's not as hot. So now we're going to go take a swim on the lake over there. So right now we're gonna go and try to clean off in this lake here, go for a swim. Probably gonna feel so good. The water is like 56 degrees Fahrenheit. Yeah. And um, it's a pretty warm day out, but still, might be a little chilly, but we're gonna do it because it's necessary. Yeah. It is. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> That's so much warmer than that. It's so it cold. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is gold! Hey, hey, move. Ready? Hold Here, take this, will you? Take this, please. Take this, please. Take this, please. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm getting out. I'm getting out. <laughs> take it, take it. Oh, my God. There are going to be someone here. Now that we uh, got that super, super refreshing swim in, we are gonna head back to camp, which is not far. And then we're actually gonna get an early dinner going, which is steak tonight. Um, gotta reward ourselves on the last night. And then um, right after that early dinner, we are going to go fishing.
Looks like a bluegill. Nice bluegill. Let's go. Nice. Beautiful fish. Truly beautiful fish. Got another one on the line. Nice one. Tiny. Not as big as the last one, but still a fish. The lake out here is just absolutely gorgeous. Still as can be. There are a couple, a lot of flies, but just still as can be out here. Mason's got a nice fish. Mason's got a nice fish. Keep it on. Keep it tight. Keep it tight. Keep it tight. You think it's a northern? Is it northern? You sure? Nice. He's taking you deep. Nice fish. Hey you guys, there's my pike. It's a nice fight. Uh, Gotta put it back now.
So there's a little bit of wind coming from this angle over there. So what I ended up doing is I moved out the tarp a little bit that way. Uh, at, before it was folded around this pole and it kind of went back this way. But hopefully this way it'll block a little bit more of the wind and we're not gonna be getting as much draft coming in at night. All right guys, I'm just heading down to the lake right now for the last, hopefully the last time tonight. I'm just gonna wash my hands and look at the gorgeous lake as the night starts to come in. Sun's starting to set a little bit, so it should be really gorgeous. Now, after I do this, we are gonna go up to the fire. The coals are getting really hot right now. We just built that awesome fire reflector, so we'll be nice and warm up there. And then, we're gonna get some steaks on the grill, along with some potatoes and carrots, and it's gonna be a great last night of this trip. Last water run of the night. Looks nice. Ready to eat now. Oh, look at that. Oh, beautiful. Just absolutely gorgeous. What do you think of it? Wow, it was really good.
right here we got some oatmeal with dried strawberries, dried bananas, dried blueberries, and dried mango. So it's the little fruit mix. Last night was a pretty good night's sleep. It rained a little bit and it was really relaxing, so we really enjoyed our last night out here in the bush. If you like the outdoors and want to see more, be sure to check out our channel and hit that red subscribe button and the bell next to it to get notified whenever we post a video. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video.